Hello, welcome to the Kitchen Concert in Aberdeenshire. Niels, Niels Eldridge is here with his Christmas jumper on. Yep. Christmas cheer. And special guest, Craig Gibson Lovey, with your Christmas jumper on too. Thank you. Welcome. It's a wee while since you've been in the concert at the Kitchen, haven't you? Was, yeah. Was it last year sometime? Yeah, I think it was, yeah. Yeah, and how, how is school going? Mixed. We're near the end of term. Yes. On the countdown. Yeah. Well, so school's not been the best. No. Mm. no. School, school. Well, and I understand. It's uh, the end of term and everyone's a bit tired. Yeah. But we're so happy to have you here and that you're going to sing along and sing a song too. Mm. That's really good. Do you want to say hi to Tom, our grandpa? <laughs> Hello. Hi. <laughs> hi. <laughs> Um, everybody is joining us now. Hello. It's lovely to have you with us. Hello. Liz is watching and Heather is watching. People from all over the world join us. You know, um, there's a, a lovely lady that I want to sing happy birthday to later. But people in Canada, America, Australia, Holland. Everywhere. Everywhere. Japan. Everywhere. You, have a, you have a global fan base. So are you feeling... Sort of festive? Yeah. <laughs> All you do is put the jumper on. <laughs> I, I, I didn't get the memo. Actually, to be honest, this is the first day that I've played any Christmas tune. So. Well, we're not actually going to do... We're not going to start with a Christmas tune because very soon you'll all be fed up with Christmas tunes, but we are going to have a few Christmas tunes. But we're, feel free to just put the kettle on. The golfer's in the background. You'd think after 150 programmes, he would know not to, you know, Close the door quietly, or we don't want the quiz, no? We're going to get a quiz. Oh boy, he's going to do a quiz. Oh yeah, I remember that. Oh, they tell their tales to the wide young eyes of the fertile plains and cloudless skies, but honesty must take the strain where lives move fast like a roaring train and the shy ones bleed while the sure ones fail on the trail of the survivor and the trade winds blow to a burning sail on the trail of the survivor and they make their moves around the virgin light Leave their filthy stains on the clear and bright But hope can never be restrained Where freedom's hands have been nailed and chained and the shy ones bleed while the sure ones fail On the trail of the Survivor and the trade winds blow through a burning sail on the trail of the survivor. Oh, 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 oh. Never gained at all, and apples, children, we rise and we fall, and the shy ones bleed, while the sure ones fail on the trail of the survivor, and the trade winds blow through a burning sail on the trail of the survivor. Sail on the trail of the 
sits he's making toast as you know at the moment but he sits there thinking up a clue and I don't know I never know what the clue is the clue is always a bit of a worry for me because I never quite know and Was, wasn't it like really bad last time <laughs> like it, it was kind of cheating I swear there was something like that that happened I think I think you could I've got a great work this week oh no, no. <laughs> someone Polaris. someone rehired <laughs> Oh, oh no, he hasn't. Polaris. Oh, right. nice Wait, okay. I have a question. Is that yes? How much does he get paid? It's not, it's not How much does he get paid? Yeah. The golfer. It's not yeah. Nuclear, golfer. Um, what? Uh, Craigie is wondering how much do you get paid for this clue business? My agent's still trying to work out a fee. <laughs> His agent's <laughs> trying to work out a fee because so far there's been about one hundred and fifty kitchen closets. He's had nothing. He gets nothing except me giving him a, you know, a bit of grief in his anyway, ear. the word this week is Polaris. The word is Polaris this week. a man today at the airport who worked for Polaris. All right. So the word is Polaris. You can all Google it right now. That's what they all do. And yeah, Houston, my friend, up in the table. bloody idea what it is. And they will be looking up. Is it not a submarine? Something to do with a submarine. They call that a submarine, but the actual word Polaris means something else. Polaris. It's actually... Well, hang on. They're very intelligent, our viewers. All I can say is they're very... They can spell. You're not allowed to say anything else. Well, someone said hello and welcome back, Craigie. Oh, that's very nice. Who's that from? I didn't see. I just saw the message and tried to read who it was. Oh. That was a shame. I thought I read Jamie. Jamie, oh, Jamie Sutherland. Jamie Sutherland. I thought that's what it was. Hello, Jamie Sutherland. It will be Jamie Sutherland because he watches every week and he is making the golfer a Christmas cake. Ooh. You're that golfer, you are getting paid in some way. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Oh, wow. Do you, do you give and you give, but you still take. <laughs> now, Niels is going to sing a song before we hear a nice Christmas song from Craigie, but we thought we, would, we just wouldn't do too many and then i just want i, I want to say um get well soon to shona donaldson because shona's got the dreaded lurgy paul miller has the dreaded lurgy lots of people seem to have the dreaded lurgy this covid bug what seems to be it? well it's covid again i think oh, it's come back in different guises so a lot of people so i'm looking forward to seeing paul and alistair another time um and hope that they get better soon um we had the most fantastic time the golfer and i we just got back from london this afternoon oh, lucky. we were at st paul's cathedral on thursday night and paul anderson played camilla the queen was there joanna lumley was there i can name drop for the world now um charles brandreth was there and um, doing a uh, charles dance the wonderful actor um so two and a half thousand people raising money for Maggie's and um, all the cancer centres that it started in Scotland in the 1990s and now there's about 24 centres all up and down the country and our daughter Hannah was the chairman of the Carol concert trying to raise a million pounds for Maggie's so I think they've just about done it. It's impressive. It's impressive. Very impressive. Yeah. Very impressive. So we're very proud of it. Anyway, Lewis, what are you going to sing? I just read Tina Faulkner Elder says North Star. Very good. Mm -hmm. Very Tina. good. 
and also the North Star is part of the Ursula Minor. And Ursula Tina Faulkner, Elder's Zeus's wife, is watching. Hi, Tina. You got it right, probably with many others. So it is. Does she know what Ursula is? <coughs> Do you know what Ursa is? <laughs> yes. I mean, so just, Ursa, oh, Grandma beer, knows. Beer, beer, beer. Beer. Bear. Oh, oh, bear. We've got Craigie's Granny's here as well. We'll, we'll do a song for her later, shall we? She's wearing, she was wearing some very <laughs> swanky boots. Yeah. You know? Very <laughs> swanky <laughs> boots. Okay, what are you going to sing? I should have done a song about boots. Yes. Uh, that's a starter. Yeah, that's a beautiful Boots made for walking. Next song. took a big stick and said the carrot was to blame It's our way or the hard way, feel free to complain Cause there's no more in the middle now, there's only on the side If you're left, you're a loser, if you're right, you've lost your mind Well, I'm a loser, that's lost his mind And that's alright, that's a sign of the time That's alright that's a sign of the time. Who are you gonna call? Get Ackroyd on the phone. E.T. is on the telecoms. He wants to go home. It's an 80s revival. They're putting actors up in planes. On a slice of nostalgia. Thank Tom Cruise. Up the game. Now I'm a pilot going at Mark 9. That's right, that's a sign of the times. Oh, that's right, that's a sign of the times. I spent a lifetime looking for that girl with the blue. She'd be grown and living on the island. And the years. Scuffled off the bottom of her shoes But you bet your soul she still got those diamonds Oh, that's right, that's a sign of the times Oh, that's right, that's a sign of the times It's been a minute since I listened to my dad's favorite band Growing up with all those songs, I know them like the back of my hand. And now 50 years later, you can watch how it was done. I recognize that tape and point my finger and say, that's the one now, that's amazing. It blew my mind to get back. That's a sign of the times. Oh, get back. That's a sign of the times. I spent a lifetime looking for that girl with the blue. She'd be grown and living on that. And the years would have scuffled off the bottom of her shoe. But you bet your soul she still got those diamonds. Oh, that's right. That's a sign of the times. Oh, that's right. That's a sign of the times. That's the sign of the time. Good song. Good song. When did you write that, Niels? Uh, I think during COVID. Yeah? Yeah. Good song. It's another COVID song. <laughs> That's when I wrote all the songs. <laughs> I'm going to put this back a little bit now so we can see Craigie. So Hello. we've got Craigie here. We've got Niels here. The golfer's there. Paula, Grandma's back there. The dogs are here. Roxy Rose Sterling is here. Um, I want to say, uh, John Conroy, you also have got the lurch. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, Roxy Rose. Lydia says hi. Oh, hi, Lydia. Oh, thank you. <laughs> okay, I want to sing happy birthday to a very special lady. Um, who watches every single week. Her name is Elizabeth McGilvery and her daughter Heidi has written to me a lovely message and Heidi lives abroad. I don't know where you live, 
Heidi, because you just said abroad, but she said, could you say happy birthday to my beautiful mum? And she watches every week. So, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Elizabeth. Happy birthday to you. And one for Donald Duck. <laughs> okay, we've got Sterling here as well. It's even busier yeah. than usual. Um, would you sing us maybe a Christmassy song? And we'll join, we'll, we're happy to join in. Do you want to come into the middle here? Yeah, sure. And sit next to Niels? Yeah, sure. Um, we, maybe Winter Wonderland? Oh, yeah. That's that sounds good. good. So, sounds good. a bit of an intro here? Yeah, I think it was this. Does that sound right? Mm -hmm. Let's get a key. Sleigh bells ring. Are you listening? In the lane, snow is glistening. A beautiful sight. We're happy tonight. Walking in a winter wonderland. Gone away is the bluebird. Here to say is a new bird that sings a love song. As we go along, walking in a winter wonderland. In the meadow, we can build a snowman. We'll pretend that he's Boston Brown. He'll say, Oh, you married Wilson, no man. But you can do the job when you're in town. Later on, we'll conspire as we dream by the fire to face on a fridge. The plans that we've made Walking in a winter wonderland In the meadow we can build a snowman We'll pretend that he's Parson Brown He'll say, oh, you're married, we'll say no man But you can do the job when you're in town Later on, we'll conspire As we dream by the fire To face on a frame that we made walking in a winter wonderland walking in a winter wonderland walking in a winter wonderland Woo! <laughs> that was hard huh? thank you great thank you. stuff well done young man it's great to have you back in the kitchen again. You, Thank you. And I love the jumper. Thank you. And you're got to support my man, Tim Burton. Tim Burton. Uh, is, is this is this Tim Burton? Yeah, Night Tim Burton. Christmas, this right? is Night River for Christmas. Yeah, Tim Burton. What's he called? Do oh, Jack Skellington. He's the pumpkin king. Do you know that um, our youngest daughter was in a Tim Burton film? Now she only had about two lines, I think. But then I was in The Wicker Man, and I only had about. You were four. what? I was in The Wicker Man. I, I had four lines. I think two may have been cut, but I think if you look very carefully in The Wicker Man, I play a character called Holly. Dan, can we watch The Wicker Man? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> I'll watch it anyways. It is. <laughs> There's no stopping me. There's no stopping me. Rules don't apply by me when it comes to age ratings. Sometimes they do. Sometimes. The thing but not all the time. The thing is... <laughs> The thing is, mm -hmm. we could sing a song for all grandmothers everywhere. Oh, that does sound good. Would that, would that be good? Yeah. Okay, now, I don't know what key... We only just sort of thought of this. Yeah. Um, vaguely... You start, you start. Okay. Oh, you yeah, can I shove your, your granny off our bus? Oh, you can I shove your granny off our bus? Oh, you can shove your granny, cause she's your mommy's mommy. You can shove a granny up a bus. Singing I, I, if he, if he, I, if he, I. Singing I, I, if he, if he, I. Singing I, I, if he, if he, I, I, if he. Singing I, I, if he, if he, I. You can shove your rubber granny off a bus. 
You can shove your other granny on the bus. You can shove your other granny, cause she's your daddy's mummy. You can shove your other granny on the bus. Sing it, I, I, it, it, I. Grannies. <laughs> Being one myself. I agree. <laughs> and it's lovely to have your grandma here. Thank you very Thank much. You. Sure you're not going to get pushed off a bus <laughs> The thing is, Grand's lucky she hasn't done, I haven't done it to her yet. <laughs> well, the thing is, we, where we are, there's only one bus a day, and we don't know when it is, so I've never actually managed to get on the bus that goes into town. Because ah. we don't know when it is. I'm going to be honest, I've had so many opportunities to do what that song says, but I still <laughs> haven't to this day. I am, it'd be funny I, though! I, I am. I'd film it and post it on YouTube, it'd be funny! <laughs> it would not. It would right. actually Now, not. I am also going to say, um, well, there's, there's a lovely lady who's listening in Atlanta, Georgia. Um, there's lots of birthdays this week. My dear friend Adeline Christie, it, she has a significant birthday and she's gone traveling. So, a happy birthday to Adeline. And, oh, and <laughs> um, I think we'll do, why don't we do Away in a Manger? Let's do another little Christmas one. Would you? Yeah, here we go. Thank you. So there okay. we go. We don't need to do them all. Okay. Yeah, we I might... got over three things. Oh, well done. Oh, Will you, do you want to come and sing Away in a Manger? No. Because no. you've got a bow I and arrow. Really could it? Hang on, yeah, I'll just yeah. bring you here. There's a bow and arrow. And are, are you enjoying? Yeah, okay. Well, oh. it's like, okay. give it a go. Parenting must oh. be hard. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, that's fine. We'll just hey. do Away in a Manger. Come on. <laughs> go Stay. talk to my grand. She'll love yes. She loves your bow and arrow. Yeah. yeah. Okay, give it to Paul. There we go. So... Let's do it. Will we do uh, about there or uh, away? Away in a manger. Will we do it together? You want to away in a manger? No crib for a bed. The little Lord Jesus lay down his sweet head. The stars in the bright sky look down where he lay the little lord jesus asleep on the hay the cattle are lowing the baby always but little lord jesus no Julie. 
God's little Cupid, wouldn't you? Your little yeah. bow and arrow, and make people no, no, fall in love. Okay, Please don't do that, man. Please don't do that. We'll go that way. That's great. That'd be great. Yeah. 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 Today. No, we're not going to do that. Grandpa. Yeah, I got you. Okay, Grandpa, I think we're going to have to... <laughs> Evacuation. I think yeah. we need to get... Yeah, evacuate, everybody evacuate! <laughs> no, people... Last week we had Naomi. Naomi, Naomi was, was running riot around here last week. Yeah! Grandpa? Loving no, it. Grandpa. Grandpa! Stop! You're not going to play Robin Hood through here. Robin Hood's no. going through Robin there. Hood's I don't think you like Robin Hood. I will go... You, we'll swap places again. Yeah, we'll again. swap places again now, first. Now, yeah. my... Our friend... Uh, Lydia is in Nashville and she's watching and actually that's fortuitous. That is good. Hi Lydia. Because we thought we'd sing a Marcus Hummond song. Yep. And Marcus Hummond is an award winning writer, mm. Grammy award winning. He wrote um, all that wonderful song for Dixie Chicks God and many other songs. Road. God Bless the Broken Road. He wrote uh, that one about the pillow of blue bonnets, blanket make of, made of stars. Um, oh, that's a fabulous song. He's written loads of songs. Anyway, this is this is one of Marcus's songs. Not Christmassy, but it sort of makes you think about the children. Like a moving river, always faster than you think. And just below the misty surface, if you try and stop time, you will sink. Though I I may not be there when you get to where you're going I plant the seed but I may not see the tree I'm growing Still as long as there's a blue yonder and the yonder's forever what I will always have faith in tomorrow's child As sons and daughters, we all become lovers or friends. Some of us are blessed to be mothers and fathers, but we all become children in the end. And though I
have. I know it's uh, it's lovely to to sing Marcus's song yeah. and hear your new songs and hear your songs and and right now I mean I know you you love musical theatre. Yes. We went. Oh. What, have you got a favourite musical? Oh. Da, I I did. Uh, I really enjoyed the new Scrooge musical. Yeah, I really I, enjoyed that. I haven't seen And Little Shop of Horrors. And Little Shop I would say, Horrors. I'd probably say my favourite musical, one that I haven't seen on my stage, I think you know where it's going to be, Little Shop of Horrors. Yeah. I love that. And my favourite um, stage play, which isn't a musical, is The Ocean at the End of the Lane. If oh. you've seen that, actually. I haven't, no. It's really, it's the really Ocean amazing. at the End of the Lane. And the yes. novel that was mm. made into a it was, it was amazing. Yeah. The Where did you see that? Was great. Uh, oh, HMT. HMT. Yeah. His Majesty's Theatre in Aberdeen. I'm going to say hello to a few people. Okay. Um, because uh, they all send in little messages. I mean, yes, sometimes some friends, <laughs> there's a friend that has a gin and tonic at six oh. o'clock with my uncle Alistair. <laughs> oh God. And you know what she says? What? Stop talking and get on with it. <laughs> hello, Kate. Oh <laughs> Mentioning no names. Hello, Chloe. And hello, Julie. Lovely to be with us. Hello, Janet Middleton. It's lovely to have you with us. Um, and I know that my sister-in-law, Linda, is watching in Dublin. And I know that my sister, Kirstine, and Deirdre, and Morrig, and Stevie, and Mandy Charlton, and lots of folk watching. Um, and I know that your grandpa's watching too, so that's Is he right. actually? I think so. If oh, he... gosh. <laughs> With me. Me. Well, could... No no pressure. Yeah, I've been seen here. <laughs> <laughs> um, now, Nils, what are you going to sing? You, we're going to have to have... I've got time where I, I don't mind. I can save it for another day. No, I would love to hear another of your songs. Yes, please. <laughs> got an I, only just wrote, I only wrote this last week. There's like... Oh, oh, don't worry, man. It's only 118 people. Don't worry. <laughs> and, by the end worried, of, but... and by the end of the week, it's sort of 10,000 or something. <laughs> really? Just go on YouTube. You can share this with you can share this with anybody you like. Oh yeah, I promoted it on my Facebook. As and well. you can watch it on your Facebook. You can watch it on YouTube to later tonight. Because Steve Baxter, wonderful graphic designer, he very kindly because I'm not very techy. Oh, you're quite actually find a way to live stream it on all services. Yeah. Or like, Are you going to show me how to do that? No, I mean like on your live stream on here, right? Is it also live streaming on YouTube? Not at the same no. time. It live streams on Facebook and then it gets uploaded onto YouTube for those who don't do Facebook. Oh. And so you can go to the Fiona Kennedy channel and see hundreds of Send them. Send me that, man. Send me that. <laughs> Send me that. You could be my youngest viewer. <laughs> To be um, no offense, I really don't think it's a good idea for people to ever see my channel. Though. I'm more a darky person. I like dark <laughs> things. I do on my Instagram. I do try to post like musical stuff and that. Well, that's good to know. I do try at times. Well, good, but I think it's important. <laughs> it's mostly art, though, actually. <laughs> so, Nils, what are you gonna? I have to. This um, is the one. I have to... You should try and remember it. I have to try and remember it, and it doesn't have a bridge yet. Mm. Because I wrote it last week, and it's just tongue in cheek, so um, I, I don't want to cause offence here for anyone. But it's impossible in this kitchen <coughs> to no. cause any offence. Uh, <laughs> Not looking just, at anyone. When you're songwriting, particularly because I do a lot of commercial stuff, so then you stick to the formula. So sometimes I like to just kind of break the formula. Uh, break the formula and we're, go we're off. We're waiting go with bated breath now. No, I hope I can remember. <laughs> I think I'm going to call it Angels, which I don't think it's going to get as popular as um, Robbie Williams. But so it's your song? You never know. Yeah, you wrote it. Damn. Okay. Okay. <laughs> A lot of angels are atheists and they won't suffer fools. They'll point out the flaws and facts and gaps in cosmic rules and maybe they don't know the good they do ignorance is bliss ignorance is bliss 
A lot of angels are atheists. A lot of angels are atheists. Don't look at me like that. It's bad enough having the golfer. He's affected you. It's. <laughs> Yeah, shoot, shoot, shoot. There's a lot of people that do. There's a lot of people that do good stuff out there, yeah. and they might not necessarily subscribe to a religion, or they don't check their statements every month at least. A lot of angels are atheists and show up just in time when you think I'm gonna drown. They're there to throw a line and maybe. They don't feel that it's a sign, but ignorance is bliss. Ignorance is bliss. A lot of angels are atheists. A lot of angels are atheists. A lot of angels are atheists. There's another good line right after this. I don't think that I'm, another, I'm, I'm, A lot of angels be. are atheists <laughs> and never make a sound. They gently fold into your life when things are upside down. And maybe they just like to be a A lot of angels are atheists. A lot of angels are atheists. Yeah, a lot of angels are atheists. A lot of angels are atheists. So that's for all the good people doing good things out there. Mm -hmm. That don't subscribe to a religion. Well, I think. May, may I just ask? What's an atheist? <laughs> that's a very That's good the quiz question. word for next uh, for next week. Oh, oh yeah, it's easy. to answer that, Manius. <laughs> an atheist is somebody who doesn't believe in God. So I'm going to redress the balance, and I'm going to sing by myself. Or you can I, join I in. I told you it was tongue in cheek, so it's not. <laughs> it's not meant to well, you did, you did sing it with that, a smile. Well, yeah, because you probably from a song, only offended I, half. No, no, from a songwriting <laughs> point of view, it's it's a nice juxtaposition because you take angels as a nice word to if sing. If you're offended, yes. then just leave. Because of the a sound, an atheist is a nice word to sing. It's got a nice balance. Mm -hmm. it, it, it's well, I'm going to sing. <laughs> we so, haven't practiced this because I just came back from London. I'm just trying to think. Now let me find it my own key. Um, in the bleak midwinter, frosty wind made moan. Earth stood hard as iron, water like a stone. Snow had fallen, snow. Long ago, what can I give him, poor as I am, if I were a shepherd, I Give my heart 
angels and archangels may have gathered there. Cherubim and seraphim thronged the air, but only his Frosty wind made moan Earth stood hard as iron Water like a stone Snow had fallen, snow on snow Snow on snow And you have redressed the balance. <laughs> That's well, a nice one. That is a lovely, it's one of my favorite. Do you have a favorite Christmas carol or Christmas song? Do you like the um, Silent Night or? Silent Night. Silent Night is good. It's like I can never remember the lyrics, but it's a great tune. Do, do you know um, Mistletoe <clears throat> and Wine? Do you remember Mistletoe and Wine? What's Mistletoe? I think so. Well, Cliff Richard recorded Mistletoe and Wine. We're really busking mm -hmm. it now. Yeah, we are. Uh, um, or I could do something completely different. I could do the Spectacles song. Oh, we could do that too. For a bit of a laugh. Does your grandma do the same thing as me? Look for her glasses all the time. All the time. To be fair, yes. It's it's not easy because I, I mean, where are my glasses? It's like I'm always kind of going. And can I, can I read this? Looking for my handbag and my car keys. Well, they can't have gone too far. Just as soon as I find my glasses, I'm sure I'll see just where they are. I'm supposed to meet someone for lunch today, but I can't remember where or who it is that I am meeting. Not good. It's in my organizer somewhere. I might have left it in the kitchen. Maybe outside in the car. Oh, the last time I remember driving was to that memory enhancement seminar. <laughs> What's that far off distant ringing? <laughs> And that vaguely familiar tone. It must be the person I'm meeting calling me on my brand new mobile phone. Where is it? I might have left it under the covers. Maybe outside on the lawn. <laughs> and I've got just one more ring to go. Before my answering machine turns on. Beep. Hello, this is Fiona. And your call is important to me. Please leave a message after the tune and I'll do my best to call you back if I remember when I get home. Beep. Hello, this is Francis calling. And I'm trying to fathom why. You didn't turn up for lunch today. 
And it was your favorite seafood pie. Was I meant to say something? No, nothing. No, no, you're not meant to say anything. Like, just find my glasses or my. <laughs> it's an old person's song, older, oh. because. Oh, so for grandmas. Yes, it's for grandmas yeah, and you. grandpas. Well, no, I won't be fair. Anyone I will without... be fair. You oh, it's all right. You can come. Old. I don't mean. You come on in. Can I be fair about something, right? Yes. Both you and Gran are not that old compared to that guy. Oh, there's an old guy there. I know. Statue. That's Bob. Statue. That's Bob. He's got a broken arm and everything. Oh, what, what, will we try <coughs> um, mistletoe and wine? Can we try that? You can just join in the chorus before we go. I and I'll just say hello to everybody that's with us. Amanda, is it in here? Keith, and Don Perlman is watching. It is. Would you... Cliff Richard recorded it. Mistletoe and wine, here it is. Or we could do that, or we could do Edelweiss. Do you know Edelweiss? Busk everything. I don't know what that is. Oh, no, I do. I do. The Sound of Music. Have you ever seen the film The Sound of Music? Maybe? No. This is the... the this is an age thing. Have you seen The Sound of Music? No, we haven't. It's called Which was the song called? Well, it's called Mistletoe and Wine. And Cliff oh. Richard recorded it. Okay. And... I don't know what key though. The child oh. is a king. Or about there? Yeah, that's fine. Or I, I could go up. The child is a king. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Beginning. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Christmas time. I think we'll go down one though. Okay. Yeah. And um, are you joining in with this? The child is a king, the carolers sing. The old has passed, there's a new beginning. Dreams of Santa, dreams of snow. Fingers numb, faces aglow. It's Christmas time, mistletoe and wine. Children sing Christian rhyme With logs on the fire and gifts on the tree A time to rejoice in the good that we see A time for living, a time for believing A time for trusting, not deceiving Love and laughter and joy ever after. Ours for the taking, just follow the master. It's Christmas time, mistletoe and wine. Children singing Christian wine. With logs on the fire and gifts on the Tree. A time to rejoice in the good that we see. It's a time for giving, a time for getting, a time for forgiving and for forgetting. Christmas is love, Christmas is peace, a time for hating and fighting to cease It's Christmas time Mistletoe and wine Children singing Christian rhyme With logs on the fire and Chris on the tree A time to rejoice in the good that we see 
It's Christmas time, mistletoe and wine, children singing Christian rhyme, with logs on the fire and gifts on the tree, a time to rejoice in the good that we see. Talk about doing stuff on the hoof. Well done. Busking. Jeez, that's called busking. It is. That is called busking. You, I know you normally rehearse. I am so looking forward to coming along on Wednesday night. Um, VSA, Voluntary Service Aberdeen. We are all doing a celebration of Christmas. And we have a wonderful star-studded cast coming along. Yeah. Um, so it would be lovely to see everyone. And a big shout out to everyone at VSA and all the choirs from VSA that are going to be singing. And um, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for coming this evening. Well and um, very well done. Thank you. Yes, thank you for your songs. Both of them. <laughs> I, one more than the other. <laughs> I like one more than the other, but you know, I'm a, it was great. Um, thanks so much for joining us. And we'll, we'll see you next week. Bye for now. Bye. Bye.